As requested, finally, I decided to sketch a requested by Amal to draw a couple sitting with a cat and we are going to illustrate this very simple but it looking complicated illustration. We are going to start off with a screen resolution of 2080 into 2860. Today I need to have some of the rough scratches where I want the building, where I want the sky and the river and the pathway has to be there because we are going to add like 3, 4, uh, I think more than 5 steps here and also don't get intimidated by how the illustration looks like because this is going to be very simple using our favorite Autodesk sketchbook app. So once we are done doing the rough sketch, I have just reduced the opacity and I have added a new layer to paint the sky. To paint the sky, I kept a color very mutual tune of all the shade of pink to purple and then a few hint of aloe making it look like a sunset and also in a very aesthetic loafy way. Just a relaxing winding of the day sitting two people by river and and enjoying the beautiful sunset so this uh, we are using coarse watercolor to add the color then I'm using blending to slowly blend it across of course for the sky we are just going to have one more layer to add those tiny scripts of sky or cloud in the sky and also you don't have to follow exactly the same color if you want to make it look more different you would definitely pick any color of your choice once we are done blending I'm going to add a new layer also make sure to keep an eye on the right side of the illustration because that's where you get to know how many layers we do add to make multiple elements in the illustration now i have added a few tone of a lightish pink uh, to the darker pink and also the purple and i'm going to use the hairbrush to slowly blend it across also make sure to follow the strength and flow of the brush based on the stylus you're using i'm using apple pencil first generation to actually illustrate and also i'm using apple sixth generation ipad a lot of questions do come up around for which of the tablet do i use for illustration and we are not doing anything special when it comes to cloud here making it difficult but just a rather a strike of cloud in the sky as the sun is going down so now that we have added i'm going to add a new layer to make it look grass at a distance with the help of dry ink, dry ink. and then i'm going to add a straight line and just add a few of a ring of grass at a distance because we are just imagining a place where you are sitting by a river and you are watching the sunset along with your pet furry babies because as requested they want a couple with a cat so once i am done i am happy how this looked like then i add a new layer beneath the glass layer and then i'm using draw style rectangle option to add the building and once we are done adding the building i'm going to add few depth to the building by giving it a slander line and then filling it the diagonal line to make it look uh, like a real building at a distance once we are done filling with the color we are just going to add the remaining same and then i'm going to add a new layer to add those light in the building and i'm going to use a tattoo ink fountain pen with a lighter shade and add the vertical and horizontal line once i am done i'm going to use cashmere eraser to remove and make it look more like a light up window in the building this kind of saves a lot of time once you add this vertical line and horizontal line and use the cashmere eraser to erase it off rather than just doing one by one at a time and also once i'm done i'm just going to merge both the layer and then copy and paste few more building at a distance making it look much more in a way that there is a housing at a distance and then you're just watching the sunset and once we are done adding those extra buildings we are done with our building layer and then we will be moving straight on to the most easiest way to add the river and once we are done adding the river maybe adding the image may be a little bit difficult to draw but at the same time i kept it as easier as i can so that everybody can illustrate and share it along with me so i'm just making few changes here to the grass to make it, it look rather than rough a little bit more smoother by using our hairbrush to slowly smudge from outside to inside and then now we are moving to the river layer where we are just copying the sky layer and inverting it along to make it look like the reflection of the sky falling on the river and then i'm going to use the darkest shade and with the help of flow airbrush i'm going to add a few color in the river to make it look little darker little more in a aesthetic way 
the dark pink the more uh, of a pink and then little yellow and then i'm going to add the pathway with the help of font and pen we are just going to pick gray color add more lighter color and then i'm just going to slowly use a flow airbrush to add the shadow after blending the lines into more realism here so once we are done blending it i'm just going to blend the edge of the pathway to make it look like the reflection falling on the pathway as well and once we are done we all have the very easy step of uh, we're just going to copy and paste invert the building layer also to make it look like little more realistic of a reflection and then i'm just going to reduce the opacity and then slowly use the hairbrush to give that wavy structure as the building is falling on the river and then we are going to add our sun which is very simple with the help of font and pen and then i pick a lighter shade of yellow with the help of draw style i just filled it and with the help of cashmere eraser i just kindly slowly uh, erase half of it to make it look like it is moving under the cloud and then with the help of glow neon pen i'm just going to add few reflection of the sun rays in the river and once we are done we are done with the entire illustration now we are just have to work on the final bit and also our shoot upper that is the couple and the cat so let's move on straight into doing the couple i'm using tattoo inker i'm just starting with the male here so there is no any easy way or hard way to illustrate this you can make it as perfect as you can but i just started with the head then i make sure i add a jacket to the guy and i added few colors of lighter and darker shade and then i am adding a ear to make it look a little more more interesting and then with the help of blending brush i'm just going to slowly blend the jacket and then i'm just going to bring few hands and to bring this entire illustration to make it actually look like a person sitting with a jacket on i am just going to use our technical pen with the help of black color i'm just going to add a few of the hair layer and then few structure for our coat itself and we are going to do the same for women but here imagine a woman is just having a low bun style and we are just not going to go with a runny flowy hair but rather just a woman sitting next to him a partner of his and then we are going to add pink jacket to her so let's go ahead and add a new layer and then start with the women so it's just like a, a low month style that's it and then she is wearing a pink jacket as, uh, the same way and then i'm just going to draw a still out of the women here like the uh, jacket uh, under her pocket and i'm going to add few more shadows and then i'm going to use a blending brush to slowly blend it across to make it look more uh, realism here and also just make sure that if you are new here you can definitely use any of the image of a couple from google and then bring it as a reference and then reduce the opacity and trace it out and fill the layer you will get exactly whatever you are looking in but this was very fun illustrating the couple uh, watching the sunset by river and also we are going to add the furry babies next to them which is going to be a cat and also i decided to add two cats since they're two people so we are just going to align them making it sit next to each other for the cat there is going to be one of a circle another is an elongated of course this looks like a little devil but just give some more time we are going to add few more structure to the body and make it look like a cat and once we are done we are just going to use a wash brush to make those highlight fall on the cat and also add some whisk of the cat whisk or viscous i am sorry if i'm pronouncing it wrong and then we are going to slowly blend the outside of the cat make it look like the sun or rather the sun something is falling on the cat also and then we are just going to give it a little more of a beauty in the shape of our cat and you can definitely name the couple whatever you want and we can name our cat my favorite way of calling a cat is tom because of tom and jerry maybe we say tom and tim and then i'm just going to reduce the size of the cat and then copy paste and add a little bit tinier cat next to them hope you guys have enjoyed this illustration see you all tomorrow till then take care bye bye